A concerning operation targeting New Mexico military families and others. A New Mexico couple used a popular real estate website to rent out their home, but quickly found out they weren't the only ones trying to make a profit. News 13 Cheyenne Cope shows you how crooks are trying to take advantage of renters. For rent, a Clovis home, hundreds of dollars under regular asking price. Sounds too good to be true? Well, that's because it is. Crooks are stealing listings from real estate sites and posting them to Craigslist as their own. It happened to Megan and Dennis Napier, both members of the Air Force. We started getting phone calls from other people um, from outside the local area, in addition to Farwell and that sort of area. Um, very excited about our house, wanting to put down two or three months worth of rent and the security deposit like immediately to secure the house. The couple posted an ad for their home on the real estate website Zillow and had interested renters within hours. But after talking with some of them, they realized something wasn't adding up. And he said, well, you know, what about your Craigslist ad? The price difference between that and the Zillow ad. A Texas woman from right across the state line also got in touch with the Napiers about the home. She said she'd been emailing the people who posted the Craigslist ad. The crooks were asking for a deposit and first month's rent sent through PayPal. They claimed to be living in Missouri and asked prospective renters to drive by the home and check it out. The Napiers found that scary because they have a four-month-old at home. Um, contacted the police department and as expected because it's an anonymous website, there was really nothing they could do except um, increase patrols mm -hmm. in the area so they would do that for us. Many of the prospective renters were military families. They're easier targets because they often have to buy homes sight unseen. And you sort of have to do that sometimes when you have a last minute turnover or you're so far away that you mm -hmm. can't take the opportunity to drive and go see. Cheyenne Cope, KRQE News 13. And the Napiers say this isn't the first time this ha has happened to them. In 2010, when Megan was stationed in Alaska, a couple showed up at their home in the middle of the night ready to move in. They had already sent a scammer rent money.